This is an AI robot replica of me. It looks like me, talks like me, and even thinks like me. Look at how insane this thing looks. It's terrifying. And we're going to see which sack is the best. We'll be competing in nine challenges like art, writing, dating, friendship tests, chess, and so much more. But if the robot wins, $100,000 worth of my belongings will get destroyed. Let's get started with the first challenge. We have 30 minutes to do a drawing. Let's see which one of us is better. Three, two, one, go! While I'm doing my art piece, the AI me over there is actually generating thousands of images. I'm going to win this. Which belonging of mine is getting destroyed first? There should be something under the couch. Oh! Phone. So if AI me beats me this round, my personal phone gets blown up. I'm almost done. Human. 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 Zach, that good. looks really good. Thank you. Not good enough. Keep going. What's 321 times 9? Uh, 2889. 2889. The human calculator is faster than the AI calculator. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds? What are you going to do? Hit me or something. Jake, even worse. It can look at your browser history. Three, two, one. All right, this is what I was able to complete in 30 minutes. Let's see what AI me generated. Oh, wow. Wait, how does it look like my art style? And now for the moment of truth, Jake, pick your favorite one. One of them really catches my eye right away. And if I was saying the truth, I would choose this one. I mean, come on. Wait, did he press it? Yeah! yeah. Jake! Oh my god, you have a phone! My phone's over there. Space Turkey's holding it. I probably should have backed it up. Three! One! Maybe it's not gonna blow up. Oh! Look at all the fluff! No! Oh, hey, look, it's my phone camera. Hey, at least I put a phone case on. That was just the first challenge. We still have dating, writing, friendship tests, painting, chess, and more. But each round, my AI robot's computing power will get stronger and stronger until it reaches the max level in the final round. This is the dating round. Me and the robot will be going on a blind date with my beautiful girlfriend, Michelle. And she has five minutes to decide which one is the real me. And if I don't get chosen, my entire curry collection gets blown up by fireworks. Got the signed curries from Legit 10. He even has a signed jersey from Jester. This is like every curry fan's worst nightmare. And without further ado, Michelle, you may start asking the questions. What day did we first meet? April 30th. That's not the right answer. June 4th, 2018. That is correct. I can't believe the AI knows these dates, but not me. Zach should know what day we first met. When is our anniversary? August 13th. August 13th. Okay, when is my sister's birthday? December 14th, 1996. That is correct. October 12th, 1995. Nothing about it was right. What did we do on our first anniversary together? We went to the movies. We did not go to the movies. We ate sushi. Yeah, we did. What do you love most about me? Sex not very romantic, so I don't know. I love how kind you are. I love how many sacrifices you've made. And I love how you balance out all of my weaknesses. That was really sweet. I feel like that could be Zach because he tells me this almost every day. I love how beautiful you are. <gasps> More beautiful than Lisa and Karina. <laughs> That is so sweet! I like the answer. How do you see your future with me? We will get married in the next couple of years. Ah! We will have two kids ah! and hopefully die old. Ah! That is so cute. I love that. He knows I love the notebook and that's how the notebook ends. And I think Michelle started to figure things out. I will say it seems like the second person is saying things that I would want to hear, and sometimes Zach doesn't like that at all. Now that time's up, Michelle has a decision to make. Do you think I am person number one or person number two? I feel like number two said things that I wanted to hear, but it's just not really you. I feel like it's really tough. I think you are person number one. Oh yeah! yeah! Yay! You got it correct! Take that, Fuse! Zach is him! I told you he would come up clutch! Yeah, I know you so well. You know me so well. Kiss. Oh my goodness. Oh his eyes just turned my red. Oh my god. Look at how insane this thing looks. What does that mean? Activating kill mode. I don't like how it just looked at me at the end. The robot's computing power has just increased. 
We are now starting one of our most insane rounds. For this challenge, I will be painting in this room, while a robot arm in another location will be replicating my painting stroke for stroke. And if my friends can't guess which one I painted, one of my favorite drawings will get shredded. Go! I'm gonna make a very abstract painting. Oh, that looks kinda cool. Would you guys actually pay more for a robot painting? I honestly have no idea what I'm making. The robot, of course, is probably doing better. Jake, how can it do better if it's replicating my every stroke? The robot is good. I mean, it looks exactly like that. I mean, worst comes to worst, it's just 50-50, right? The robot is definitely getting better and better. It looks exactly like Zach's art. It's amazing. And if the AI beats me, that piece of art gets shredded. I spent like 60 hours on that piece. I think this challenge is going to be really close. I think Ben might have a little bit of a hard time choosing which one is Axe and which one is the AI. All right, robot hand, let's see if you can replicate this. I better see this. Let's see if it can copy that. Oh, it got copied. It's crazy how the AI still is copying Zach's painting stroke to stroke. And I think I'm done. Whoa, it's so colorful. Now it's time to put this side by side with the robot hand painting to see if Ben can tell the difference. Okay, I wanna try to pick out a difference. I can't believe it's robot so arm hard. did this. Zach, I'm scared. I'm scared. I think I know how to decide. The best way I know how. Let's flip a coin. All right, heads is green, tails is red. Heads. I'm going green. Oh! How was I supposed to know? I'm sorry. You know what? Ow! <laughs> I feel so bad. I'm not gonna lie. I think this is gonna hurt a lot. No! <laughs> okay, should I just put it in? Yeah. yeah. Get it over with. Three, Three two, two, one. Oh god, oh god. It sounds terrible. What is still going? Two weeks of work gone in 10 seconds. It can't work. There, there. I can't believe we just did that. No! Oh my god! Bro, you can tape it back together. Wait, why do I feel like this is like my art piece, like ash? You look like we're at a funeral. Banksy shredded his art piece and it's worth way more, so maybe this will be worth way more. You know what? I'm gonna give it to one of you guys, my subscribers. So if you subscribe, you could get the remains of my art piece. You guys ready for the next round? Yes. Our next round might be the hardest round yet. We will now have 30 minutes to write an essay. And I even brought in a real English teacher to grade it. This is Mrs. Caitlin, a real English teacher. Hello. Wait, are you a hard grader? I've been known to be a pretty hard grader. For this round, if I lose, I have a little league team at my house that will destroy my entire bedroom. <laughs> and now let's decide what our essay topic is. All right, we're just gonna draw from here. Marriage. Oh boy. You're about to take an L this round. <laughs> okay. Let's start writing. The first thing I need to do is do a little bit of research. What, what do I title the essay? <sighs> Teacher, do you have any recommendations on essay titles? It should be short, it should be punchy. So I'll just put marriage in all caps. This is all I have, it just says a marriage. It's already done? It already typed out that essay, this is all I have. Did you just kiss the robot? The boys told me to. Michelle, will you marry me? Hey, wait, wait! <laughs> no, 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 Michelle, go back over there. Time was running out and my mind was still blank. It also didn't help knowing there was a little league team at my house ready to destroy everything. Okay, so my essay is getting printed right now. You probably shouldn't have dropped out of school. <laughs> That's it? That's all I wrote? Okay, so these are the two essays in comparison. Dang it, my conclusion was a sentence. Miss Caitlin, so we are done with our essays. I'm not gonna tell you whose is whose. I'm just gonna start with the long one. Okay, very strong title. What Wait, did you say strong title? Very strong title. And so far the grammar and spelling is very good in this one. Whoever wrote this has a strong lexicon. Is that something bad? Oh no, it's very good. Now this essay actually branches out into the social context of marriage. I, I'll be interested to see what this essay says about that. I'm sure that one also has plenty of social context. Yes. I'm gonna go into the next one. The title of the next one is all caps, marriage, exclamation point. How come that's all you wrote? Beginning of a sentence, not capitalized. No apostrophe, did not capitalize. We don't need to read it out loud. I think it's short enough where maybe we could. You, just the letter U, <laughs> are gonna. 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 <laughs> After you have the proper identification. Huh? Walk in the what? Then marriage is like a roller coaster. What the? You might get sick on the way down. 
<laughs> and now it was time to see the grades. All right, so the first essay, love the ideas, a little antiquated. I gave this essay an A minus. So the second essay had some issues. First off, yeah, that was me, teacher. You cited Google as if it were a person, and you have a few run-on sentences. So I gave this. D plus. <laughs> well, at least it has a smiley face. I did, I did the smiley face. Oh. I thought that would kind of soften the blow. Time for your room to get destroyed. Three, two, one. destroyed. In this game, my AI robot and I are on opposite sides of this huge room. And this is my dog Bacon, sitting in the center of the room. She's a good girl. But if she crosses the red line in front of the robot, I have to give a complete stranger $10,000. Hey, Daddy. You like? Oh. Oh. She's used to like the AI robot. Does AI Zach have real Zach smell? Zach, are you ready? Yes. Zach, are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one, go. Come here, Bacon. Bacon, come here. Bacon, come here, Bacon. Not looking so good. Come here, Bacon. Come here, Bacon. Come on. She's running towards bacon, the robot. Bacon, bacon, come on. Come on, Bacon. Come on. Come here, Bacon. Come here, Bacon. Come on, Come on, Bacon. Come on. Come on, Bacon. She's running towards the robot. Come on, Bacon. Bacon. Come here, Bacon. Come on. Come on, Bacon. Come on. Here you go. Come here, Bacon. Bacon, you're almost there. Come on. No, Bacon. Come on, just a little bit more. Come on, come here, Bacon. Yeah! Big girl, Bacon. You see, my dog is loyal. We don't like the robot, do we? We are now on round seven, the friendship test. In this challenge, my friend Jake will ask us five questions to see if he can figure out who's who. And to make things more difficult, he has headphones on that will distort our voices. For this next round, we have Jake's car out in the field, and if he guesses wrong, it gets blown up. Keep your eyes closed. What do you think this is? This is a car. It's your car, Jake. Where's your my license plate? Oh, well, we took that off. Right now, the car is filled up with explosives, so if you guess wrong, this blows up. I get it right, I know you. This is for you in case the car does get blown up. All right, Jake, follow me. Are you nervous, Jake? I'm very nervous. I thought that I was just competing for a prize. Are the questions easy? No. How would you rate my looks on a scale of one to 10? 11 out of 10. He gives Jake an 11 out of 10, but gives me a 10. Getting on 10.1, you're extremely unique. On a scale of one to 10, how funny am I? 10. 10. Zach and Michelle wrote me a little card and they wrote that they love how I can make them laugh all the time. Next question. What is your biggest pet peeve about me? Is Zach honest or is AI Zach honest? You tend to arrive to everything late. <laughs> <laughs> That was literally the exact same answer that person won game. When he has somewhere to be at 8 o'clock, he takes a shower at 7.55. My car's gonna explode! How good of a friend am I? 10. 9.5. <laughs> I can't guess. I really have no idea. What does our friendship mean to you? It means the world to me. It means a lot. The answers from person one and two are so similar. This is impossible. Now that Jake asked all the questions, it was time for him to make a decision. The answers were pretty personal on each side. Person number one's answers, I thought they sounded more human-like. But then I heard person number two's answers and they were all so personal. Those answers easily online, but they're so similar, but... <laughs> Okay, person one. No! Oh! Jake is so dumb. His car. Jake, it shows the robot. Jake, I thought we were good friends. We are. We were. What do you mean? Jake, I guess follow me out to the field. Oh my god, this is the prank part. This is the prank part. Alright, let's blow up the car. Three, Three two, two. Just do it. Oh! Look at the door. Wow. It's still in the air. That was insane! There goes your car! This is a door? Wait, here's another door. Hang on, Jake, let me check. 
sorry, Jake, your car didn't make it. It's literally a piece of Jake's car in the tree. But little does Jake know, I wasn't about to leave him without a ride. Come with me, come with me. I got you a brand new car. Whoa! Yeah, you like it? Yeah! Maybe you should blow up my car. Hey, Snarky! Hey! So it's safe to say you're not mad at me for blowing up your car, right? No, not at all. All right, I'm gonna test how to drive home. Jake didn't grab his keys. Your keys, J your trunk, Jake. The trunk's not even close. All right, let's go to the next scene. And now it's time for a game of chess. The AI robot is now cranked up to the highest level possible. Each of us has 25 minutes on our clocks, but every time I make even a tiny mistake against the robot, my friends get slimed. Let's flip a coin to see who goes first. AI me, heads or tails? Heads. Heads? All right, it's heads. The game has officially begun. Pawn B6. Oh, bad move. Pawn B6. Mistake. <laughs> Every move I make is just another mistake. Honestly, very hesitant to even move right now. You gotta go faster than that. I should have brought my beads, or, you know. On B5. No! That's a blunder. That's another bad move. No! Why are you so scared to propose to Michelle? I feel like that's kind of personal. It's just a big change in... Queen C8. Hurry up! You're losing, you know. Yay, I got a piece. Mistake. <laughs> mistake. That's another mistake. A7. <laughs> Watch the time. Pawn takes. Okay, my time's already starting to run kind of low. I only have seven minutes left. Okay, knight takes bishop. <laughs> time's running up, Zach. Oh my god! Uh oh. So I did not see that. It's time to run away. What the hell was even that? Why is this AI so mean to me? Ah, 420! Look at that! Oh no! <laughs> you lose in a few more moves. Two moves. One move. Man, that was brutal. I can't! So far, I've faced my robot AI replica in art, friendship tests, writing, chess, and now it's time for our final round, a 60 minute drawing competition. And if I lose, my Tesla gets blown up. And little did I know, Jake had something else to add. All right, Zach, this might look a little bit familiar to you. That was the first gift you ever gave me at the start of our relationship. You can't lose the watch. Promise me you'll win. Zachary, promise me you'll win. It's gonna be even worse if he loses this round and it blows up with his Tesla. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready. Go! Okay, I need to think of something I can do in one hour. What's gonna beat it? Think about what's what on do. the line. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking about. I'm not thinking about what I'm doing. Wait, where did Jake even get that watch? I'll need security. I ended up sitting around for 15 minutes just trying to think of an idea. Okay, I'm restarting. I hate this. Starting. I don't think I can beat the robot by going more impressive, but Turkey is one of my characters and I feel like that's very unique and dear to me. Oh my god! <laughs> I keep blinking, I keep blinking. I don't have a lot of time left, but I'm gonna have all my loved ones around me and it's gonna be conquering this robot planet. I have around 10 minutes to do it. And this is you, and you're carrying our two babies in the future. That's so our two cute! Babies. Three, two, one! Oh. For an hour, it looks pretty good. All right, it is time for Jake to judge this piece. Here it is. They're very different. The AI one just looks so dope, but then again, I really can't tell what it is. The other one, though, it's not quite as impressive, I'd say. Hand-drawn, it looks very nice. I need you to choose one. I can tell what it is. It looks so cute. It has a great story. Let's That's go! You know what, I just got an idea. Let's move the explosives from my car to the robot. We're destroying the robot! This is gonna be the coolest outro ever. Three, two, one! Look at the hair! Don't underestimate the strength of your individuality. I learned during this challenge, your unique traits and passions are your secret weapons that set you apart in a way no robot or human can replicate. I love you guys, goodbye.